It's the farm of the future. Set up inside a laboratory, this indoor space has been transformed into an agricultural center with ideal conditions. Controlled temperature, lighting, humidity, and even CO2. Panasonic's vegetable farm in Singapore is intended to help provide a stable food supply on the island as population projections are expected to increase globally. Alfred Tam manages the farm, which produces 10 vegetables. Our LEDs are specially designed. We simulate two out of seven sunlight rays that is necessary for photosynthesis. We control the settings and durations of the lights to achieve optimum cultivations for our crops. In addition to lighting, lab techs measure and control soil moisture and pH levels and use filtered water to achieve optimum growth and quality. With all these techniques and control, we are able to shorten our lead time by half compared to traditional farming. By focusing on vegetables that are traditionally imported, like mini radishes and baby spinach, the Panasonic farm is able to cut costs to the consumer. Now for the taste test. Food blogger Trisha Tan and her companion tried the veggies in a salad at a local restaurant. Very fresh, very crunchy, and it tastes like a little bit sweet, like, you know, really fresh. I really taste like a very fresh kind of veggie. Back at the farm, growers say the harvest is still quite small, but they hope to account for 5% of the island's leafy greens by 2016.